What is up my beautiful friends? Welcome back to the channel. I hope you guys are doing well. I cannot believe we are already at the end of 2018. I feel like this year just blew by so fast and that we are already starting 2019. It is kind of incredible. I can't believe how far we have come. It is crazy. Anyways, today we are going to be talking about some girl boss habits to slay 2019. I am so excited. I feel like 2019 is going to be the best year ever. I am like beyond excited and I cannot wait to start the new year. I think it is going to be great and I'm just so excited. I can't wait. Anyways, without further ado, let's get on with the video and I'm going to share some habits to reach your goals in 2019. So the first girl boss habit that I want to talk to you guys about is to get up early and get shit done. So I know getting up early can be complicated for some people. Not everyone's an early riser. I certainly was not an early riser for a long time. But you get into the habit of it your body ends up getting used to getting up earlier so by all means start by 10 minutes 15 minutes just you know slowly and then eventually build up to an extra hour you have an extra hour in your day to be really productive so don't worry your body will get used to it trust me it will but honestly guys it is so important that you guys wake up early because then you have an extra hour to do a lot more things for yourself or do things that need to be done. So what I like to do when I get up early is that I like to meditate and journal and just do some things for me. It also gives me more time to make a healthier breakfast than me trying to rush out the door and you know shoving a granola bar in my mouth. So if you want to be a girl boss in 2019 and really step up your game, I really recommend waking up early and getting it done. Don't stay in bed, don't scroll through your Instagram feed. Honestly, use that time and be super productive in that time because you have that extra hour in a day and you can get so much done. Also, sorry, the lighting keeps changing, keeps going behind clouds, so it keeps getting like sunny and dark and all that stuff. So yeah, sorry about that. Anyways, that is my first tip. It is to get up early and get stuff done. That will help you be so much more productive in 2019. So another way to be a girl boss in 2019 is to get your own mantra. So mantras are really great for motivating you and just really starting to believe in yourself. I think that in 2019, it is very important to believe in yourself, guys. Honestly, really, please believe in yourself. You guys are beautiful human beings. And so this year in particular, I'm choosing a mantra for myself and I think that everyone should choose one for themselves as well. Mine is to be unstoppable. That one catchphrase, that mantra, I repeat to myself every single day and it just makes me so much more excited to get things done and just accomplish my goals. So of course, like I said, mine is to be unstoppable. I know that Remy Aston on here, if you know Rem, hers is similar, hers is she's unstoppable. I think that is such a great mantra and there are tons out there. So if you guys want some inspiration, just search on Pinterest for some mantras. If not, just kind of look around and find one that suits you. And so far this year, the one that has been suiting me is to be unstoppable. So find something that really suits you guys and just find a mantra and repeat it to yourself every single day. Or whenever you're feeling kind of down or feeling a little stuck or you just want some motivation, just tell it to yourself, like me, be unstoppable. Why not? So my third way to be a girl boss in 2019 is to get organized. I find this so important, you guys, organization is like literally key to so many things. So for me, being organized is bullet journaling. I've just actually started incorporating that into my life in the past two months. If you guys saw my plan with me for November and December, I'll have it linked down below. You guys can check it out. And my next video will be planning with me for 2019 and January. But bullet journaling has changed my life. Before when I saw bullet journaling, I honestly was like totally not interested in it. I thought it was kind of a waste of time and I really didn't like it. But honestly, it helps me be so much more productive and stay on top of things. You guys aren't interested in bullet journaling, just choose a planner. There are so many planners out there right now. Like honestly, I went to Target and Walmart and there's just like tons of them. They're beautiful, they're cute, you know, all aesthetically pleasing. And so just choose that if you're not into bullet journaling, but I really recommend if you guys are kind of interested, check it out because you can customize it to you and your life and just make it your own thing. It's also a way to be a little more creative. So. Being a girl boss in 2019 means staying organized. So my next girl boss habit is to social media cleanse and to social media detox. Those two things are very important in the new year. So to social media cleanse is to get rid of some unhealthy people on your social media feed, especially on Instagram. I find that there, there are so many unhealthy profiles that make me feel bad about myself. So try and cleanse them. Don't follow those people because in all honesty, you don't need to feel bad about yourself. It's not necessarily anything against them. Yes, they can post about their perfect lives, but if it's making you feel bad about yourself, 
it's not worth following. So many times I'll be scrolling through social media and I'll see a skinny girl and I'll be like, why am I not like that? 2019 is not the year to compare. So guys, honestly, get rid of the people that make you feel bad about yourselves. It's not worth it, it really isn't. And just put positive things in your feed, people who make you feel good about yourself. And also to social media detox, I find myself scrolling through my social media mindlessly all the time. It's a bit ridiculous, like I'll literally be walking and I'll just open the app and just scroll through it for no reason. And it's completely ridiculous, like there's no reason why I need to be scrolling. Like it's become such an addiction and such a habit where I just scroll through social media for no reason. So what I like to do every once in a while for a weekend or something, especially when I'm trying to be more present, is that I'll delete all the apps off my phone for a weekend and just detox from it because honestly it is so annoying to pick up your phone and just scroll through it and not do things that are productive. You become mindless and you just you know, forget about life and you stop living life because you're constantly scrolling through social media. So guys, if you want to be a girl boss in 2019, I really highly recommend detoxing from social media. Delete the apps for a weekend, step away from it, and do something that's a little more productive. Another girl boss habit that I think you guys should incorporate in 2019 is to meditate. And I know a lot of people think meditating isn't for them. I used to think that meditating really was not for me. And when you start meditating, yes it is hard because that voice inside your head really does not ever shut up and it's actually quite annoying. If you are just starting out meditating, I really recommend guided apps. I've used Headspace, that is a really great guided meditation and they do have free guided meditation. So I really, really recommend that app. If you guys are looking for some guided meditation, it's not necessarily anything spiritual, it's just to quiet the voice inside your head. Sometimes the voice inside your head can really get going and can really aggravate you and just put thoughts in your head and your head just doesn't stop. So if you want to relax, have five minutes of peace because that voice doesn't shut up. I really recommend meditating and trying it out. And it doesn't necessarily need to be every day. It can be twice to three times a week, every second day. Just try and incorporate it in your life and really makes a huge difference on your mental health. And mental health is always important, especially in 2019, guys. We're going into a new year. We need to work on our mental health. It is so important. My next girl boss habit is to get fit in 2019. I know that is a huge goal for a lot of people in the new year is to get healthy. And guys, it is so important to get healthy. For me, I really recommend that girls pick up some weights, pick up a barbell and start weightlifting because why not? We are girl bosses. We get to have muscles. We're allowed to have muscles. We're allowed to be strong as hell. So guys, make it a priority in 2019 is your health. And it's so important to get your body moving, guys. I want everyone to be healthy out there and I want everyone to have healthy bodies. So please make fitness a priority guys. It is so good for your body and it just makes you feel so much better because when I don't work out, I feel like a huge slob. I feel slow, I feel lethargic, but when I work out, I feel so much better, so much stronger, especially because I lift some weights. If you guys are looking for some motivation, I'll leave a link down below or in one of my last videos, I tell you guys why I love to do CrossFit and getting fit just makes you feel so much better. I'm not saying to get skinny, that is not what I'm trying to say. What I'm trying to say is to get fit, get strong and feel healthy. And that leads into my next tip to be a girl boss is to eat right for the new year. Of course, if you wanna be fit, you also wanna be healthy by eating the proper foods. It is so good for your body. If you guys start eating proper foods, if you guys start eating plant-based foods, you guys know that I always recommend plant-based foods. If you guys start incorporating a lot more of that into your diet, you will feel tremendously different. You'll feel a lot more energetic. So just go to the grocery store, pick up more greens, pick up more fruits. You guys will feel so much better. Just try incorporating it little by little into your life. It doesn't need to be a drastic change. Add some more fruit to breakfast, add some more greens to your supper. Incorporating it just little by little will make a huge difference and it is so good for your body. Your body needs the proper nutrients. You guys know if you have been on my channel for a while that I always stress plant-based foods. So that is something that I really recommend if you want to be a proper healthy girl boss in the new year, eat your proper foods. Also something that I will be incorporating in my life in 2019 is that I will be trying a new meal each month. It might not sound like much, but I'm so used to eating my typical meals that they kind of get a little boring. So I decided in 2019 each month, I know it's not too hard, so it's an attainable goal because we don't want to try a new one every week because, well, I'm not gonna attain that goal. So I'm gonna try a new meal each month, a new healthy plant-based meal each month to incorporate my diet so that I have a little more variety. So if you're looking for a little goal that's actually really easy and attainable, try incorporating a new meal, try something different in your diet every month and you'll see quite a difference because you'll be eating more plant-based foods, guys. And of course, another girl boss habit that you guys need to incorporate in your life is to drink 
more water. Honestly, cut down on the sugary drinks, cut down on the alcohol and incorporate just more water into your diet. Water is good for you, water is meant for you, water is everything in all honesty. And of course it'll make your body feel so refreshed and so, you know, clean and all that jazz. So I really recommend just adding more water into your diet and just drinking a lot more water because you know, all our bodies need it. We always need more water, right? So the next girl boss habit that you guys should incorporate in 2019 is to keep learning. It is so good for our minds to keep learning about literally anything. You guys can keep learning about yourselves. We're always developing, we're always changing, or you can just try and learn about a new subject. There's so many things out there and it is so good for your mind to keep learning, guys. Nobody can master anything. No matter what you do, like filming a video, doing YouTube, doing whatever you do, you can always learn about it. So if you have a hobby that you're interested in or if you're just looking to self-improve anyway, I really recommend to find ways to keep learning and just learn more about the subject. There's always new knowledge out there. We are not just stuck at one level. We can always keep learning. It is so good for our minds to keep learning. So if you wanna be girl boss in 2019, I really recommend to keep on learning. So the last girl boss habit that I think that everyone should incorporate in 2019 is to give your body the rest that it needs. We are constantly asking our bodies to do many things like fitness, we're constantly moving our bodies, work or school, we're constantly putting our bodies under stress. As I said before, get up early, get shit done. That's constantly putting our bodies under stress a little bit. And so it's very important to give back to our bodies as well, whether that's resting through a nap, a book, a bath, or getting a massage, it's very important to give back to our bodies and let our bodies rest because if we don't do that, then we get sick and we don't feel good and our mental health goes to crap. So we wanna keep our mental health in good game this year. That is what 2019 is. And so give your body the rest that it needs every once in a while. It doesn't need to be every day, but it's very important to just give back to it. So don't forget to give your body some rest. So I will leave a bunch of links down below to some videos that have been motivating me recently. If you guys are looking for some motivation in fitness, I will leave my videos down below. I also have a video from Mix Squats that has really motivated me. If you're looking for some fitness goals for 2019, she made the perfect video and I absolutely love the video that she made. So I'll leave that link down below as well. So if you guys have any questions or any comments that you wanna say, leave them down below. I'd be happy to read them. And if you guys like this video, give it a big thumbs up. And if you're not already subscribed, hit the subscribe button down below. So yes, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. Summer days burn me out, love just brings me down. Gold inside like when she leaves, I slowly leave the ground. Hey, you come back, I wanna give you a chance. Love me like you used to, so we can learn again. The skin is getting round, baby.